Welcome to episode number two of this Vinny J NHL 23 Be a Pro series. And today I'm obviously and today I'm obviously playing my Vinny J NHL 23 Be a Pro series. Um, it's episode number two, like I just it's episode number two, like I just said, and like I said, or or it's episode number two, like I just said, 20 seconds ago, and like it says in the title, uh, there's some major implications on the line here in this last round robin game. Uh, Vinny J's on the Hamilton Bulldogs. We're about to put the Edmonton Oil Tins. We're one, we're one, one, zero, and zero. And the Oil Tins are two, zero, zero, and zero. You want to think why they head to their four, like, sections, like, four sections. Well, there's win, a regulation win, a regulation loss, an overtime win, and an overtime loss. And you might be thinking, why is it not, why is it not just wins and losses? Three, well, the reason why is because you get three points for a regulation win, zero points for a regulation loss, two points for an overtime win, and one point for an overtime loss. So that's why there's four categories. Um, yeah, Vinny J is a 16, 69 overall. He's played the first innings of the round robin round. He has no points. He has a zero for goals, assist, points, uh, zero for plus minus. He does have six penalty minutes, which is not a good thing, and ten shots. And I think he has probably somewhere maybe around like five to seven hits, but he has no. Like I said, no points, and then a zero for plus minus. So I gotta step it up because at this rate I might get, I might be the last pick of the draft. Um, well, they're not saying that I've been playing really bad, but if I don't, if I, I if I did zero points here in the Memorial Memorial Cup and still get picked first overall by the Montreal Canadiens, I'll take being picked first overall, obviously. But obviously I'll feel like I didn't deserve it. Uh, but obviously, there's still at least this one day, last round robin game, and then if we win this game against the Edmonton Oil Tins, we are definitely going to the playoff round. Because there's four teams here in the Memorial Cup. First place team, it's a buy right to the Memorial Cup final. Second and third place team, the second and place team and the third place team play each other in the semifinal, and then the winner will play the number one seed in the final. And then obviously, the winner of the Memorial Cup final wins the Memorial Cup. And then the fourth place team uh, doesn't make it to the playoff round. Right now, we're in second place. The Oil Tins are in first. So there's a possibility if we win the same in regulation, there's a possibility we could get that one seed. But even if that does, if, even if we don't get the one seed, if we win this game, we control our own destiny about making it to the playoff round. If we win this game, we're definitely in the playoff round. Uh, so, yeah. And even if we lose this game, especially if we lose this game in overtime where we did a point, or, or even if we lose this game in regulation and did zero points, we sh we might still be able to make it to the playoff round, but I know for a fact if we control our own destin destiny about making it to the making it to the playoff round, if we win this game, we are in the playoff round. We might be as a two or three seed and not the one seed, but as long as we're in, it's all I, or as long as we're in, that's all I care about. So yeah, we're, I am playing the entirety of this game. I am playing a full. I am playing the entirety of this game against against the Edmonton Oil Tins. Uh, we are the road team, so the game is in Edmonton, or the game is in Edmonton. So it's the Hamilton Bulldogs at the Edmonton Oil Tins, and let's do, and let's stand to the game right now. Happy New Year to all of you watching. As I'm filming this video on New, Year, New Year's Day, but either way, for you guys and me, it's 2023. 2022 flew by just like that. Um, so, yeah, happy 2023, happy New Year, and hopefully I can get uh, at least one point here in this game, and maybe a goal. That is me on the left, away uniforms for us, home uniforms for them. We both have the same offense, but they have a better, or we both have the same offense, but the Oil Tins have a better defense and goalie than the Hamilton Bulldogs. Style, traditional length, uh, length five minutes, still semi-pro, on his trainer adaptive. Let's get into this third and final round robin game uh, right now. It's the third and final round robin game, but hopefully it's not our last game of the tournament, and it won't be unless we don't make it. Uh, and it won't be our last game of the play, of the tournament or the Memorial Cup unless we don't unless we don't make it to the playoff round, which hopefully we do. Let's watch a presentation. Uh, Jane Sabalski. I'm ready too, James. Here we go. Memorial Cup, game three of three of the round robin round. A lot of implications on the line. I'm over at right wing. You're on line number one as you're on your way. You're in Edmonton as we lose a face-off 
to start the game. That guy just got destroyed. A save by the Hamilton goalie. Here's Vinny J. Up the right win. Slams on the brace. And a, oh, that was close. And now Vinny J got it back. And that just missed. And that guy just got clobbered. And he lost his helmet. So if you lose your helmet, you have to go to the bench here. Here we go. And a shot saved by number 33, our goalie. Just under two minutes into the game. No score here in the round robin round. And in this round robin game, the last game of the round robin for both of these teams. A lot, of sins, a lot of implications on the line here. No scores. We lose another face off. And I, oh, I thought he was going to shoot it. Here's a shot. Hit a lot of bodies in front. Here's 23. I don't know who 23 is. What a hit. In the Memorial Cup, I usually just say numbers because I don't know any of these guys. Here we go. Here's uh, Neighbors. I know that guy because it had his name below uh, where he was stating. Not sure who that is, but it just says Neighbors. Here we go. Slapper! And it was blocked by a guy in front. Wasn't me, though. It did pass by Vinny J up to 19. And 19 just got destroyed in front of the bench. Number four. Oh, I thought he was going to. I should have went to the bench. But I can't now because we're, in, because we're in our own zone. And here's a shot blocked, but they got it back. After the, I bought the first shot, but it was stopped by our goalie, and he covers it. 15-15, uh, they go in the first, no score. And I'm on the bench, so yeah, that's not a good start for me. Well, I did block the shot, but at least they didn't score, the oil tins, that is. Here we go, and it's now one up in oil tins, 7.49, they go in the first. So that's not good, and Coach is going to talk to us. 7.49, they go in the first, we're now one nothing. Vinny, we haven't had any sustained pressure. I need you to change that. I can do that, Coach. I'll swing the momentum in our favor. So, so the challenge is up the pressure. Okay, let's up the pressure, boys. Here we go. I'm at left wind because you can see the number. No, I'm at right wind. Just I thought. Uh, here we go. Good win. Number 44's got it. I'm number 7 to number 44 is right. I got it. Here's all. I thought I tried to did it over to 23, but it was blocked by a oil tins player. And that didn't work at all. Kind of late coming back here. And a shot. Oh, oh my. As he got it back, but did save by our goalie. Up ahead, Vinny J. 19 to my left. Here we go. Over. Oh, I got it to him, but then he lost it. Here's Neighbors. That's the only guy I know like, by name for either of these teams here. Here we go. Vinny J's got it behind the net here. Up ahead, 19. At the red line. Here we go. Oh, I should have called for that putt. Should have called for that putt. Send the state to the bench again. Four and a half to go. This guy's dead. And he is dead right in front of the Bulldogs bench. I destroyed him. Here we go. Here's 23. Feed me. Feed me! Oh, what a save by the Oil Tins goalie. Here's a shot. Love save by, I believe it says Costa as their goalie, or Casa. Man, I had a one-on-one -on -one there with the goalie. And that was close. So, end of the first period, uh, one nothing Oil Tins, and it's four-on-four, -four, it says. So, let's say it's like four-on-four to start the second period. Um, so, yeah. One of the shots looking like shots 10 7 in favor of the oil tins. Hits, sits, sits. Time of attack, uh, the oil tins have about a minute more. Passing, almost even. Face offs 10 5 in favor of the oil, of the uh, Bulldogs. Uh, World for one on the power play, and then the oil tins haven't had a power play. So let's get into the game. Or excuse me, let's get into the second period. Uh, 1 0 oil tins. And I believe that's yeah, 4 on 4, so I'm at right win. Uh, one, uh, one, or, uh, second period, uh, it's four on four for, uh, 35 seconds, it says. So, we're five seconds into the period, 30 seconds to go in the four on four, and then I'm not sure if someone's going to do a power play, or, if, and that's a penalty on me. So, now it's four on three for a minute and 20 seconds. As I hit the die, I didn't have the putt, which is one, interference 101. So, now it's a four on three power play for the oil tins, which is not a good ten. And we, at least we killed it off, but now it's a 5-on-4 power play. Uh, so yeah, no, no. Okay. I, don't, I was going to hit that. I'm not sure if they have a power play or not. It doesn't say they have it, but I think they do, because I only see four Hamilton players. Good play. No, I see five now, so it's 5-on-5. Five five. Here's Vinny J. Got through everyone. And, oh, lost the puck. Man, I tried to pass it back, but that didn't work. Come on. 
And a slapper! And I got blocked in front by another player. And now right in front, trying to wrap around that stop by the Hamilton goalie up ahead, number 19. She's at 19 and 23 on my line. That didn't work at all. Here's Neighbors. And I just destroyed him. I've hit it. I'm hitting people. And Neighbors is, looks like he's down a little bit. Shot stopped by the goalie. Oh no, don't pass it there. And they score. Well, that's my fault for calling for the pass, but. But pass it. When I call for the pass, pass it to me. He passed it where I was like two seconds before that. And then I sent another shot, and the next shot, like five seconds later, went in. Unassisted, 14 minutes ago in the second, and we're down 2 nothing. That's my fault, boys. And a save by the Hamilton goalie. Come on, here's 23. 23 got through everyone, and a shot! Oh, what a save by the Oil Tins goalie. Come on, do something with it, dude. Right in the slot, Vinny J's got it. Here's a shot to be score! And that's Vinny J's first point of the Memorial Cup. As it not the, uh, I did get an assist on that goal. And it's a 2 1 game. That's number uh, 19 who scored. As it was, I believe I got the second assist because number 23 was in the slot, tipped it, and it was stopped by the Oil Tins goalie, and then it was put in by number 19. I believe I got, I got the second assist. I got it one, the first or second assist. I had the second assist, as it was assisted by uh, n number 23 and, and Vinny J, and it's a 2 1 game. My first point of the Memorial Cup, and it's now 3 1 Oil Tins, 8 16 to go in the second. So we scored a goal, but then when I was off the ice, the Oil Tins scored another goal to be up by 2 again. And that was a bad Vinny. Remember, my player, player name is Vincent. It used to be Jack, but now it's Vincent. What a hit by number 2! What an absolute hit. Here's number two. Just destroy that guy. Here's number 23. Got through everyone. And now, what are you doing, dude? Then it lost. And then he lost the putt. Here's Williams. And I buy, I have like seven hits in this game or something. I do have that one assist. Had the second assist on our only goal so far. What a hit now. Picked up by Vinny J. All the way up ahead to 19 to score the goal. Here's 23. Shoots it. Save. Still loose. And it went back to her feed. A shot. Oh, I almost tipped that in. Stopped by the Oil Tins goalie. 4.45 the Dow. 3-1. You didn't miss anything. Uh, I'm off the ice again. I'm having some quick shifts now. They're not... Come on. Score one, maybe. And we did score one. 46 seconds to go in the second. 3-2. As the period's on over. 35 seconds to go. As we're within one. Maybe high in the next 20 seconds. But the oil tents have it, and the thoughts are going down quickly. And they turn it around in front of the bench. And I hit everyone off the puck. I dot it back, but offside was my teammate. 3.1. So that's, I mean, unless we win it cleanly and come in and take a shot, I don't think we're going to tie it here. But at least we got one, uh, a goal, made it 3-2. But right now, the difference in the, in that day, in the game is that goal off of my turnover because the goalie passed it to me. And I called for the pass, so it was my fault. Here we go, 3-2 oil chains after 40 minutes of play here in Edmonton. There's the goal by number 19. As I just said, I'd have to set an assist on that goal, so that was my first assist and first point of the Memorial Cup. Third period, let's go, 3-2 oil chains. Here we go, down one, third period. Let's come back and win it. And we lose a faceoff, and what a hit! Five sentences into the period. Here's Neighbors, who clearly wasn't hurt enough by my hits. And to play by that guy, but then he just backed himself into a corner. I mean, that, why would he just go, go up the ice? Here's 23. 23. Here we go. Over. Benny J. Oh, just hit the goalie and went wide of the net. And now this guy lost the putt, but his teammate was right there. And turned over. 23's got it, but the Neighbors stole it. And now I just knocked neighbors down. It was a little late, but no interference or anything. And now a shot they score. And the oil tins are backed up by two. I mean, you did not play defense, or you just gonna look at him? I know that was kind of my fault, because I, I should have been... I was behind him and sitting in front of him. But, like, I, there was two players there, or at least one Bulldogs player there, maybe even two, and they just looked at him. So now it's 4-2. 
Here we go. We're not dead yet. Here we go. There's 23. And down at the Vinny J. I spun all the way around. Sean is fun, got it back. Dead in shot was stopped by the goalie. And now it's in the corner. And I just destroyed that guy. But unfortunately, the other oil tennis player picked it up. I'm hitting everyone possible. And my teammates just let him walk right in. Here we go. A backdoor feed. Oh! I tried to bring it across the crease instead. Of, I accidentally passed it on net instead of across the crease. I had a guy back door and it was stopped by the oil tins goalie. What? Cosa or Casa. Man. 15 minutes. We're down by two. 10 or 11 to go. We're still down by two. Here we go. I'm just praying that we don't. We're not the team that gets. Doesn't make it to the playoff round. Here we go. Shoot that. Oh, what a save. Here we go. Vinny J's got it. Shot. Stop. Rebound. What a save. My Cosa. Or Casa. 8.52 the down. We're still down by two. Time to attack. We have about a minute more. But unfortunately, we're still down by two. With under nine, with under nine to play. 23 saves for the Oil Tins goalie off the face-off. I've got it. And that's the point. And number two wants right in going to the right side, dude. The, the glove side was open. Eight, 17 the Dell. I mean, go right side, dude, and we lose a face-off. Here's Peters, another guy I know on this team. Here's Neighbors. It's Neighbors and it's Peters uh, I know on this one of Ken's team. And to poke by number eight. Here's number 23. Come on, let's get one here. Why are you, what are you doing? Oh, what a turnover. In front. Oh, point blank. And what a hit, Vinny J. Caused a turnover. Shot. A block by an oil tennis player in front. 23 to stop demolished. Coach at the way by Vinny J. On goal. Thrown out by the goalie. Sits the play. We're down 4-2 still. Come on, let's get one here. To Pote. Up ahead, here's Humphrey, 22. Humphrey shoots it. Oh, there was a player in the crease. And now that is offside as it went out and I was in the zone. Offside with 5.02 to play. Now might be my last ship because it's going to go to the bench. I'm a C-plus overall. I do have that one assist. Come on. 118 to go. It's still 4-2. I might be coming on for the goalie for all we know. And uh, no, I'm coming out of that during a during a stoppage of play. Now we lose a face off. There's only one ten to go. Still five, we haven't pulled our goalie or anything yet. Come on, pressure the puck. Oh no, I actually I blocked the pass. Here we go. And uh, we haven't pulled our goalie yet. Pull the goalie. Save him on the star! And we're not done yet! It's number twenty three with the goal! And it's four to three with forty nine seconds to play. The second goal of the, of the tournament, 49 seconds to play, and we're within one. I'm not sure why they didn't pull, pull the goal out. We might have to, uh, another assist. We might have the second assist again, but now it's 49.1 to go, 4-3. I did get the second assist. Here we go. And now number two, here's number seven, Finnegy! Oh, I almost got by his blocker. And now, Finnegy! Over! Oh, no one was there. 30 seconds. Come on, pressure the putt! I just don't let him walk right in, dude. Come on! What a hit! Now 23's done at 20 seconds. I'm not sure we're not pulling our goalie still. And a shot save rebound! Oh, at the side of the net! And now another shot of some rebound! And it's on top of the net! went over the net! Seven seconds! Vinny Jay's got it! I got demolished! And there's three seconds! I'm slow to get up! And the oil tin player got destroyed at the buzzer. We never pulled our goalie out of that. I'm not sure why we never pulled our goalie. But in the end, it's, it's a moot point because we, because we lost 4-3. But oh my! That puck was on top of the net! With like ten seconds left, the puck was on top of the net! Top of the, it was on top of the net, and oh my. <sighs>
And I did it to assist, as I assisted on a what? Not exactly a goal, but a chance to if we hem them in, hem them, hem them in their zone. Coach, we just lost. He had the same conversation with me after we lost our last game 2-1. Because we won our first game 4-3, we was 4-3, and then we lost our second game 2-1, now we lose our third game 4-3. So we won 4-3, lost 2-1, and then lost 4-3. Second, third star was, I believe it was number 23, one goal, one assist, two hits. We outshot them 35-27, but lost 4-3. Uh, second star was a player on the Oil Tens who had one goal and one hit. And then the first star, it's probably an Oil Tens player because they won. Um, and the first star is a guy who had one goal and one assist for the Oil Tens. So I did have two assists in that game, but unfortunately, it's not enough. I, as, as I assisted, as you can see, I played 30 minutes and two seconds. No goals, two assists, two points. A zero for plus minus and seven shots. But I'd have to mollish at the end. I had seven hits. I had two penalty minutes, so two minutes for interference. Uh, the Oil Chin scored one goal in the first. We scored zero goals in the first. And then both teams scored two goals in the second and one in the third. But the Oil Tins won the game 4 3. As I assisted on, uh, yeah, I got hit with five seconds left. And then someone hit, a uh, Bulldogs player hit a Oil Tins player at the buzzer. But at the end, it didn't matter. But I want to see that replay. With a, I believe it was like 10 seconds, that putt, yeah, I don't know why we never pulled our goalie, like, I don't know, but this putt was on top of the net, look at this, I think that was me, I accidentally, uh, no, that wasn't, was that me? No, it was 23, he, he shot it, right pad saved by the Oil Tins goalie, 19, shot it, it hit the pad of the goalie, hit the goalie, Went up in the air, and I, you might, uh, I don't know, zoom in here. You can see the punt is right there. So I'd zoom out, or rewind. 19 shoots it, stop by the door, pops up in the air, hit the top of the net, and then went over the net. We were really close to tying the game. I wish that putt went in the net, obviously, instead of on top of it and over the top. But it is what it is, and if we don't make it to the playoff rounds, um, and the, the NHL entry draft will be in this episode. That's if we don't make. That's if we don't make it to the playoff round. I'm praying we do, but because we lost in regulation, well, we finished what one two zero and or one two zero oh, and zero oh, with three points, which hopefully is enough for at least third place. Because if we're fourth place, which is last place, we're not. We're the one team that's not in the playoff round. So unfortunately, I lose. I did. I did get my first two assists and two and my first two assists. And my first two points here in the Memorial Cup. So at least I'm not, at least I'm not shut out points-wise at least during the Memorial Cup. Goal, I still have zero goals. I had seven shots, seven hits, played just over 30 minutes, had the two assists. And we'll find out in a moment here if we made it to the, the playoff round or not. It says the round robin has ended. But the question is, do we have another game? We're definitely not the one seed, but hopefully we're at least the three seed. Because if we're the f fourth place team, we're definitely out. It's right here. So we finished 1-2, 0-0 oh, oh, with three points. And I... No, well... It says we're in third, but the problem is with that is there's... The problem with the Oil Tins finished 3-0, oh, uh, oh, oh, and 0 oh, with nine points. So they finished perfect. They finished perfect. They had 12 goals, 4, 5 goals against. We had 8 goals, 4, 9 goals against. But then the problem is that there's a St. John Sea Dogs, who we lost to in the second game of the tournament... They're playing this team, the Shenwanden. I'm not trying. To, I'm not. I'm not gonna try to pronounce that team. But this is the team that uh, that are, that is a O two O and O. That's the team we beat in the first game of the tournament. Um. So that team that we beat in the first game of the tournament, and then the St. John Sea uh, Dons. They haven't played their third game yet, and they're playing each other. So. Um. So if well, the uh, scenario is if the if the Sea Dons beat the team that we beat in the first game of the tournament, um, even if it's in a, even if it's in overtime, doesn't matter if it's in regulation or overtime. If the Sea Dons win, we're we're in the playoff round because in this team, the fourth place team right now would be 0-3-0-0, would be 0-3-0-0 with zero points. And then the only way that we would not be in the playoff round is if this team, the team that we beat in the first game of the tournament, wins in regulation. And then if that does happen. Then the Sea Dons, the Bulldogs, and then this, the, and then the team that we beat in the first game of the tournament would all be tied. 
So then uh, there would be a three-way tie, and then obviously two teams have made it to two teams have made it to the playoff round, and then one team wouldn't. So we're basically rooting for the seed odds here. So because if they win in regulation or overtime, we we still make it to the next round. So we'll find out momentarily here um, if we're moving on to the playoff round or if we're not. And like I said, the NHL entry draft will be in this in this episode, and that, all that stuff will be in the next clip because this, because this clip's about to end. So I'll see you on the other side. See you then. So, like I said, we're going to find out right now if we made it to the playoff round or if we didn't. Here we go. I'm going to send a day to June 1st. So, I don't, now let's see if, if that day has been played or not. Here we go. And the day has not been played. So, yeah, we haven't been it hasn't been played yet, but it should be played probably today. Because today in this game is June 1st. So, we'll find out maybe now if we made it. Okay, now it's June second. This is anticlimactic, but it's not my fault. And we are moving on to the playoff round as the Sea Dogs take 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 care of business as they beat the well. I'm not not trying to pronounce that team, but they beat the team that we beat in the first game of the Memorial Cup. So that team finishes 0-3-0-1-0 with zero points. We finished 1-2-0-1-0 with three points. The Sea Dons finished 2-1-0-1-0 the Sea Dons finished 2 one with six points. And then the Oil Kings finished 3-0-0-0 with nine points. So we are the three seed, and we are playing the St. John Sea Dons again. But this time we're playing them, um, well, on the road. And this time we're playing them in the semifinal. So we are moving on. Although we went 1-2-0-1-0. Well, that wasn't... The worst, we weren't the worst team, so we're in the playoff round. We are the road team. We will be the road team now in the semifinal because we're the lower seed. But at least we're in the playoff round. And there's a conversation with a, a reporter. As uh, yeah, even if we win this game against the Sea Dons, we have for us to win the, for us to win the Memorial Cup, we will, we will have to win this against the Sea Dons in the semifinal, and then and then and then we had to, and then we got to beat the Oil Tins in the final, which we almost beat the Oil Tins in the last game. We only lost by one. Uh, Vinny, your performance hasn't been great, but with the help of your team, you made it to the sem to the semis. Uh, how are you feeling going into it? It's always a time to play at this level. I'm a bit worried about my game, but I know my team has what it takes. I mean, I did have two assists in the last game. Uh, you haven't b been playing your best. Is there something you're working on to give your opponents a run for their money? Uh, getting the puck in the net is gonna be the is gonna be the key in up in my game. Yeah. Uh, so your goal is more goals. Ha ha, makes sense, I suppose. Good luck. Ha ha, you did it. See ya. Oh, no. So I got, uh, plus 75 teammate, plus one, uh, shot. Or I got se plus 75 teammate, and then plus one for slap shot, accuracy, and power, and then plus one for wrist shot, accuracy, and power. Oh, no. And then I just said plus 75 teammate. Uh, yeah, I only have two assists. Hopefully, I can get on the board goals-wise uh, here in this game. Uh, semi-final. Memorial Cup. Uh, for some reason, it still says round robin, but it's a Memorial Cup semi-final. Bulldogs at Sea Dogs. Winner will play the Oil Tins in the Memorial Cup final, and obviously the loser will go home, and we're going to play the semi-final right now. Winner moves on to the final to play the Edmonton Oil Tins, and the loser will go home. We are the road team because, like I said, we are the lower seed. So, yeah, play tall, or not play tall, but, uh, style church, no length, five minutes, still semi pro, honest turn, adaptive, nothing changed between this game and the last game, so let's get into it. Uh, if we do make it to the final, the final, if we do make it to the Memorial Cup final, that will be in, in the next episode of this series, and if we lose this game, the next episode of the series will be the NHL draft. Most likely, there's a possibility if we lose this game, the NHL draft might be at the end of this episode, maybe, but I doubt it. And if we win this game in the final... The Memorial Cup final will be in the next episode. Let's watch a presentation, or let's watch a presentation. Uh, Jane Sabalski, Memorial Cup semifinal. Now yeah, one team's moving on to the final, and the other one's going home. Memorial Cup semifinal here at us in St. John, uh, because we are the road team. Fans, uh, let's say this place is rocking. Sound that this place is rocking as we're on your way here in the semifinal. Here we go, Hamilton, let's try to down the board first, but come on, pass it up. Who are you passing it to? 
Oh, turned over almost by nine or by uh, the other team. Other goalies got it, and I just destroyed that guy, and he lost his helmet. So he has to go to the bench, but unfortunately they are on offense and offside against the uh, Sea Dogs. Just under two minutes into the game, no score. Winner moves on to the final. Loser will go home. We're one and two. They're two and one. Up ahead, Vinny J. And a center and pass! Oh, not off his stick. And now another center and pass! Got broken up. Now Burns has got it. He got turned it over. Show my 19! Stop through a screen by the goalie. 17 12 the down, no storm. Lose a face off. Here's Burns. I'm not sure this Burns is. I don't think it's Brett Burns of the Sharks or whatever team he's on. Here's a shot blocked by Vinny J. And it goes out of play. Whistle is blown. And I'm off the ice. So the only thing I did on that shift was block that shot, which I'll take it. 11:31 to go in the first. No score. Here we go. And right off the bench, I get the putt. And I slam on the brace. Feed to the 19. Save. Rebound. They score. And the Bulldogs strike first in the semifinal. I don't think I did an assist because I believe uh, the other team had possession of the putt. Third goal of the playoffs for uh, that guy, which was number uh, 23, I believe. Yeah, 23 got the goal. Because my linemen are number 19 and number 23. I don't think I got an assist. It was unassisted because... The other team got possession and turned it over, so no, so it was unassisted because the other team, like said, because the other team, like I said, had possession and turned it over. Here we go. Here's a shot. Same roll it was right there. But I did get a plus one for being on the ice for that goal, so I'll take it. And we strike first in the semifinal as we're halfway through the first. One nothing Bulldogs. Here's a slapper. Stopped by the annoyed juicy rebound, but no one was there for. Uh, no one was there in white. Here's Vinny J. Right to the slot. And I was hit from behind, so I missed it by a mile. And that didn't work at all. Here we go. And a poke by Vinny J. And I double hit X. But I'm going to get that put to myself. And I, did, but I put to myself. Oh, my goodness. And I almost turned over by the goalie. He got it back and covered it and held it. But, man, that... That side was open, but he stopped it with the uh, with the glove. And it's two nothing. As we did score a goal with 4:54 to go in the first, it said 2:30 to go in the first, and we're up two nothing. And a poke by Vinny J. But and I got destroyed. But somehow I popped right back up somehow. This guy's destroyed. Oh. Well, I was say this guy's not get destroyed, but I barely bumped him. And I right to the slot, intercepted by 21. I'm not sure why 21's out here. It might be a defenseman, because I see 19 and 23 are out here. Down low, to the slot, and I broke it up. 20 seconds, 2 nothing Bulldogs. And I poked at the line. The number of buzzer beaters, 23, 7 seconds. Here's Vinny Chaney, and I hit a stick. Turned over. And that is the end of the first period. As one last shot stopped there, Bart. Stopped by our goalie, but it might it probably going to be too late if it went in. 2 nothing Bulldogs after 20 minutes of play here uh, in St. John. So, good start for us. We outshot them not 8-1 uh, in that period. 8-1. And that's not, and that one shot was not the shot at the bu uh, after the buzzer there, because of the, and yet the tractor, tractor doesn't say there was a shot. That one shot was not that last shot at the buzzer. It didn't, that didn't count as a shot. So, they only had one shot the Sea Dogs did. We had eight, and we scored two goals. Second period, here we go. Two nothing Bulldogs here in the semifinal. Here we go. I have no points, but I do have that plus one rating for that goal I was on the ice for, that first one. Um, here we go. And I kind of bumped that guy and didn't get any points for it. I'm not sure why the goalie doesn't come out for that. Here's Vinny J. Come on. Bring it up. Here's at number eight, 
And I don't know what the heck that was. I think it was put shut away by a sea dodge. Here we go. And a shot saved by our goalie. And uh, he covers it a minute 45 into the second. But like I said, if we do make it to the final, the final will be in the next episode of the series. But this video is probably, I don't know how long it's going to be, but it's, I, don't want, I don't want the semifinal and the final in the same episode. Because it will be too long. Because there was already a game before this, the last game of the round robin round. Here we go. Come on. Any day now. And, well, just like, you just like fiddle around like way too long. I double hit Etsy then because they just fiddle around way too long. And... Kuznetsov. Almost turned over. Destroyed him. Turned it over. Here's 23 scores. What a play by Vinny J to create the turnover. And it leads to a Bulldogs goal. And we're up 3 nothing. Second goal of the game for the number 23. And it's 3 nothing Hamilton. As the hit created a the hit by Vinny J created a turnover. And it led to a goal. 3 nothing Bulldogs. I don't think I ever touched the puck. So I don't think I got an assist. I did not, but I kind of I caught I basically created the scoring chance because of the hits that led to the turnover, which led to the goal. So now I have a plus two rating, and I probably have like six hits. Here we go! There's a shot, save, rebound, right to number two, and number seven. Benny J has some space here. Twenty-three is to his left, and oh, I still have it, and that almost went in, and that was like a screenshot. And now it's in the corner, kicked out of the wrong team. Vinny J got it! Oh, that almost went in. And it's out of the zone. Vinny J's got it now. Vinny J, a center and pass 22 is stopped by the goalie. That's Humphrey, and now it's turned over. I died it to the bench here. 13 minutes to go in the set down, and we're up 3 nothing. Nine minutes to go in the second. Uh, power play for the Sea Dogs. Still down 3-0. Here we go. Power play is at, well, it says 159, but I'm not sure exactly what it is. But number eight, it's a putt after we're on the face off. Clear it all the way down. Power play is at 150. Dane Slot is at 850. Here we go. And I, I'm kind of late. I might, get, might lose some points for being a late batch. Yet. Here we go. Oh, I double hit Etzadin. Darn it. This guy's dead, and he is dead. Sit down. This shot, and then it's oh, I thought it was going in. It popped up in the air, and it, but doesn't go in. It's covered by the goalie. But what a hit! Surprising that wasn't boarding though. But they usually call that boarding or charging, but no penalty. 125 they're on the power play. 825 they're on the period. Here. And we're in the face off, short-handed. Vinny J with like a turnaround shot. That was a, the weakest shot I've ever seen. And now a center and pass. Here's Lawrence. And he walked right in, but stopped by our goalie. He didn't miss anything. I'm probably off the ice because I saw my energy bar was like yellow. Uh, so yeah, 31 seconds to go on this power play, I believe. Or something like that. 7 on 1 to go now, so it's like a minute later. 5 on 5. Still 3 0 in Bulldogs. Here we go. Here we go. It's in a corner now, right to the slot. But a good play by, I believe that was Vinny J. Here's 23 as I pass it up to 23. Here's 19. And, oh, that's the 20. I thought that was passes to me. Oh, how did I miss him? I just missed him. By, I think I bumped him. It's not enough. 540 to go here. Good hit. Oh, what a hit. Up ahead, Vinny J. 23 is in my left. I'm on side. Vinny J's got it! He shoots it! I waited too long because it was blocked. That guy just got crushed. What are you fun? Oh, I lost it! Oh, I was like point blank range. If I didn't lose it. Four minutes, stopped by the goalie. And he covers it with 403 to go. 3 0 in Hamilton. Still have no points, but I do have to have a plus two rating, I'm pretty sure. And I have a lot of hits, and I have some, I have sh some shots too. Three and a half in Bulldogs after 40 minutes of play here in the semifinal. As we're 20 minutes away from the Memorial Cup final, the Bulldogs are. So this game is not over until it's over. And if we do play the Oil Kings in the in the final, it will be in, in it will be on the road at the end because they're the higher seed. But can't be too far ahead of ourselves. Still 20 minutes to go. Still up 3-0.
Here we go. Last regulation period of the semifinal. 3 nothing Bulldogs here on the road. We, as we're 20 minutes away from playing the Oil Kings in the Memorial Cup Final. Rev is interference! Just sit down, buddy! And I saved by the goalie, but I destroyed that guy, dude. I have a lot of hits in this Memorial Cup and in this game. I have a lot of hits. We lost to the St. John, uh, St. John Sea Dons. I believe it was what 2-1 in our second round robin game, but we're up in this game 3-0. And a centering pass. That stop. Oh, I was close to going in. And that guy just got destroyed. And a backdoor feed. What a save by the goalie. But I have maybe 10 hits in this game. <laughs> I'm just killing everyone, dude. I'm an enforcer. Well, my archetype is actually a sniper like Alex Ovechkin, but there's now 800, what, like, seven goals or whatever uh, in real life. Here we go. Phoenix is still at zero here in the morning. Oh, top, man. Trying to go top shelf. But stopped by the goalie. A minute 45 into the third. That was a good save. Had, I've, I've had my chances. Still studied those two assists here in, the, here in the Memorial Cup, which I got in the last game of the, uh, the round robin round. And that guy just got crushed, and then crushed by me. And oh, a backdoor fiend! Oh, it's intercepted by number two. But I had 19 backdoor. And a backhander stopped by the goalie, and I called for the pass. and went to 23. And now it's a bank pass. Vinny J might have numbers. Slam on the brakes. Got by a guy. He shoots it. Oh, so close. But yet so far, blocker save. Oh, I... Wrong guy. Here we go. Here's Lawrence. And now a shot! Tipped and saved! Loose! Up ahead. Here's 23. And he wants right in and scores! And I went right into the slot and went right by the goalie. And then once I cleared, number 23 shot it. And it's 4 nothing, and it's a hat trick. As you can see, the hats being thrown on the ice, despite it being a road game, the hats are being thrown on the ice. Three goals for number 23, and it's four to nothing. As I call, I kind of did a goalie stream by going right by the goalie, and then once I cleared out of the way, 23 shot it and scored. Blocker side, four to nothing, Bulldogs, and that's a hat trick for number 23. And despite being, a, despite being on the road, the hats were still being thrown on the ice here in St. John. Here we go, 11 minutes to go here, and I'm on side, barely, here's number 10, and now 14, missed the net, and now Vinny J's got it, he'll shoot it, score, but it's not Vinny J's goal, as it's tipped in front by 23, as number 23 tipped it in, so it's not my goal, I did it the first assist though, his fourth goal of the game, and we're up 5 nothing. As, yeah, if that wasn't tipped, that probably was going to be saved by the goalie for St. John's. But, uh, yeah, if that wasn't tipped, it would have probably been a save. But it was tipped in. I'll still take the goal. Or I'll still take the assist. And it's not a goal for me. It's the, it's not a goal for me, but I did get the first assist. And the fans are booing here in St. John as we are up 5 nothing with 10 and a half to go. Uh, that is new where the fans are, that, oh, that's new where the fans are, uh, there's a shot stop by the goalie, but that is new in NHL 23 where the fans boo and cheer, and right now they're booing, which I don't blame them because their team's down 5 nothing. I mean, if this is if this is real life and I just said Texas Stars were down 5 nothing, I would be booing. 9.35 to go, 5 nothing, and number 23 has four goals. Here's Vinny J. Can he actually did a goal, and now he turned the puck over. And, okay, turned it over. But I do have one assist because I did shoot the putt that number 23 tipped in which is his fourth goal of the game, and the Bulldogs' fifth goal of the game, as he has, number 23 has four, over, four out of our five goals. 8.30 the down, we're up 5 nothing. And that, as far as not wasn't interference, but I time did bump him. Here's 19. I'm not sure who has the other goal. Pretty sure the other goal was by uh, someone that was not on my line, because it happened when I was off the ice. And I'm off the ice now. It could possibly be the game, 7.30 the down. If it is, it is. Uh, it, might, it might be. I doubt it, though. 4.47 the dough. This is probably my last shift. 5 nothing. And I do have one assist in this game and a total of three assists here in the Memorial Cup. As here's number 10. Up to have Vinny J. Here's Vinny J. Is there a guy back door? There is! And he waited to on the shoot and rebound was loose! And it's not 
in the net? It's not in the net. The goalie covers it, turned around, but that looked like it was in the net, boys. Well, must have not been, or it was, and NHL 23 glitched down and said it wasn't a goal, but whatever. I don't think it was only my goal if it went in. Here we got the face off, and then, oh, what a save! As I started to say, we score, as I think you guys heard it, I was about to say, I was starting to say they score, but they only said no with the glove. 3-37. Yeah, you caught it, not a uh, goalie, but you're still on 5 nothing with three and a half minutes to go. Here's Burns, as we're three and a half minutes away from the, the final. And now a shot! Save! And I kicked out of there. I don't know who who it was by. Here's number 10, though. Up ahead, 19. And Vinny J blocked. The shot was blocked. And now a center and pass save with 1.30 to play. And now number 10, I hit hard. And I took the wrong angle at the puck. And I have to go to the bench here. I don't have to, but it does say that. And that's going to be it for me in this game, most likely. 50 seconds. I'm not sure why. Oh, okay, there it goes. Uh, for the Simmons. 50 seconds. This should be the game it is. We did the shutout, and we're going to the final. Our goalie gets a shutout, and the Bulldogs are going to the Memorial Cup final here in 2022. As we celebrate, sits are thrown in the air, and gloves are thrown in the air by the Bulldogs, and our goalie gets a shutout, our goalie gets a shutout, and the Bulldogs get the win 5-0, and we're going to the final. And the captain, captain the first to shake hands, the greatest tradition in hockey, or in sports, the handshake line. There's no trophy here in the semifinal, but there's a trophy if we win the uh, Memorial Cup final, which hopefully we do. It's only a battle, though, against the Oil Tens, who just beat us in the last round robin game 4-3. We were there against the Oil Tins in our one matchup against them. Beat them 4-3, as you can hear the boos still happening here at the arena. As our goalie's the third star of the game. He got a shutout as the third star of the game because second star is, I think, the, is the guy that scored the other goal that number 23 didn't score. Number 23, four goals in the game. And then the second star is the player that scored the other goal for the Bulldogs. That's, that's the second, that's, who the, that's who's the second star of the game. The Bulldogs player who didn't score, or who, the Bulldogs player that scored the, the other goal that number 23 didn't score, and then the third star is our goalie for getting the shutout. We outshot the Seedons 28-18, and we beat them here in St. John's. Although it's at St. John, but I think it's St. John's, like plural. But either way, we beat them. Uh, yeah, we, we just beat the goodies out of them. We beat the crap out of them, really. Um, yeah, I mean, we outshot them only by 10, as we had 5 goals on 28 shots, and then obviously they had 0 goals on 18 shots, as our goalie makes 18 saves on 18 shots. Number 23, Mason Matt Tavich, that's his name, 4 goals, no assist, 6 shots, and a plus 4 for plus minus. I believe I finished with 1 assist, I'm just confirming. Uh, yeah, I finished with 1 assist, played 33 minutes and 48 seconds, no goals, 1 assist, 1 point, a plus 4 for plus minus, and sit shots as well. So uh, I only got that one assist, so I still have zero goals, but I have zero goals, three assists, three points uh, here in the Memo here in the Memorial Cup, and I believe I have I believe in in the Memorial Memorial Cup I believe I have a, I have a plus four right in now because coming into the episode I had zero uh, I had a zero for plus minus, and in the last thing I and, and in the last thing I had a zero for plus minus, so I believe I, have a, I believe in the tournament in the Memor Memorial Cup I have zero goals, three assists. Three points and a plus four for plus minus. A lot of hits and no goals. I have a lot of shots though and a lot of hits. And let's go out to the main, me main menu and sim up to the. Let's and let's go out to the main, main. Let's go out to the main menu to sim up to the final. Okay, so um, yeah, uh, we did win. You didn't miss anything or anything. 
Uh, you didn't miss anything. Um, we won. We're going to the final. I had one assist, one point, plus four for plus minus, six shots, seven hits. Played 33, uh, 33 minutes and 48 seconds. So I played a long time. Obviously, that's, the clock does go faster in the same than real uh, real life clock because it's five minute periods. Because 20 minute periods would take 10 and a half hours to play. Um, and what's my agent talking about? Uh, update on my draft ranking? Yeah, tell me. Is it going to be first? No, uh, you're only 95th. Hmm. Okay. 95th. I'll take it. Obviously, 95th is probably, what, like the third round? Fourth, uh, 95th pick right now? Or nine, going 95th? If, if I were to go 95th, would be late third round, early fourth round. You're only 95th. You gotta focus if you want to pull it up in time. You're only 95th. You know, like I said, like I said, you're only 95th. You've got to focus if you want to pull it up, pull it up uh, in time. All right, I'll pull, I'll pull a bit more effort, or, I'll, or all right, I, I'll put a bit more effort into it. Okay. Uh, more than just a bit, more than just a bit, please, Vinny. This is the time to go all out. You're right. I'll go at it with everything I've got from here on out. Which we only have one more game, which is the Memorial Cup Final against the 3 0 0 and 0 Edmonton Oil Tins. So we're playing the Oil Tins who are 3 0 here in the Memorial Cup. Because obviously they have to buy right to the final. Okay. And I have a conversation with the reporter, which I'll try about the final, but. Uh, So Vinny, you haven't you haven't been at your best this tournament, but the finals is your, but the finals is your last shot to show what you're made of. What are your thoughts on such a critical game? I really gotta step it up my day. I I've, I've really gotta step up my game. My team's been really supporting me up to this point, so I've gotta get it together for them. Okay. It sounds like you're coming into this with a plan. Is there something you've been working? on in preparation for the finals. Right now it's, mo it's most important that I'm the player for the I'm the player the team needs. I'm going to play my best for them so we can win this for our fans. Uh, sounds like a good plan. I'm sure your team likes the sound of that. Good luck on the ice tonight. Appreciate it. I do appreciate it. After that, that'll be in the next episode of the series. The challenge from the reporter is win the next game. Which is the cha which is the finals, and then I got plus 225 for teammate, and then the challenge from the, from the reporter is win the next game, which is the mo which is the mo which is the Memorial Cup final. Um, so yeah, the last night I had that one assist, and total after four games, I have zero goals, three assists, three points. I'm a still a 69 overall. Uh, yeah, I mean, apparently it's a disappointing Memorial Cup, which it kind of is, because I don't have a goal. I do have three assists, though, uh, over, over four games, which all three assists came in the last two games, uh, in the last game of the round robin, and then the, in the semifinal. But if I can get, like, maybe a two goals, maybe, like, two goals, and maybe, like, one assist or two assists, and I have, like, maybe, like, a three- or four-point game that's in the final, which may or may not happen... If I have like three or four points in the finals, which may or may not happen, I might bump up my draft to maybe like 60 or 70, maybe 80. Because like it's a 95th right now is my projection for the draft. So uh, the funny thing with this is last year I had like four or five assists only in the in the Memorial Cup, and my per, draft per, per, uh, projection was first, and I went second to the Seattle Kraken. And here I have three assists, and I projected it, projected. It, projected to go 95th, which is, like I said, late third round, early fourth round, give or take. Um, so, yeah, if I can bump it up to, like, 60 or 70, maybe 80, I'll go, if I bump it up to, like, maybe, like, 70, that'll be, mid, that'll be a middle of the third round, give or take. So, I don't know. If I, do, I mean, if I go, hopefully I go sometime in the third round. Hopefully I'll go in the fourth round. But if I do, I do. And either way, I don't know who has a 95th pitch. I mean, that could be anyone. It could be the Dallas Stars could be the Dallas Stars, Tampa Bay Lightning, Colorado Avalanche, Los Angeles Kings, etc. And I don't know how I got those four teams. I know how the Dallas are my favorite team, so that's how I, that's why I said them. But the other three teams I said 
those are just, those were just the teams that came first in my mind. But yeah, next episode of the series will be the Memorial Cup Final, and then I'll probably after uh, after the Memorial Cup Final, I'll probably uh, play. Uh, I'll probably well after the Memorial Cup Final, regardless if we win or lose. Um, uh, after that, I'll uh, I'll do the NHL Entry Draft most likely, and then after that, I'll maybe play like one the first preseason game uh, with Vinny J's NHL team, whatever team he's on, maybe. But next episode of the series will definitely be the Memorial Cup Final and the NHL Draft. Most likely, or definitely the Memorial Cup Final, and then most likely the NHL Draft. And then maybe if my first preseason game with my new team. or And then maybe my, uh, and then, and then maybe my first preseason game with uh, whatever team that drafts me. It would be cool if I got drafted by the Dallas Stars, which is my favorite team. That would be cool, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Hopefully that's episode of the series will be in a couple days. It should be in a couple days, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, did I stand red? Closing the board. If it's up to the like button. Subscribe, subscribe if you haven't yet. Tell your mom, dad, grandma, and grandpa, aunts, uncles, pets, and friends about these videos. And you know what? I'm going to see you in episode number three of this Vinny J NHL 23 Be a Pro series. See you in episode number three. And you know what? A bacon and go Bulldogs. And... And I'll see you in the Memorial Cup Final. See you then.